welcome back to Let's Play Alan Wake 2. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're here in a bunker where uh, things are kind of miserable. Oh boy. Shout out to Justin Jones, who says, I can appreciate clever game design used to protect plot-critical NPCs. Rose is the most disturbing sort of insane. Mixing the truth in with her ramblings. Worse, those truths might just save your life, sanity, or the rest of the world. And, uh... Shout out to Clunk279, who says, Oh god, I just realized something. What happens if you bring an AI writer or artist to the dark place? I feel like that... Something about it not being a person makes me feel like that wouldn't work, but it is a very interesting thought. A computer could be manipulated into writing whatever the fuck you wanted. And, uh, one last note here. Shout out to Torek00, who says, On Alan's absurdly fast revolver reloading speed, muscle memory works independent of cognitive memory. Just how many times do you think he's reloaded that revolver? Which is a very good, it'll be a somewhat dark point. Which just makes it appropriate for this game, of course. recognize these rooms. I mean, there's nothing in them that is not unfamiliar. They don't even look like ruined versions of previous rooms. Big red button inside a central control area. I don't even know what it does. You took Tor. I'm here to take him back. I need to get the lights into him. Oh! That really got me. Uh, just suddenly, uh, Cynthia ran up, grabbed me by the face, and uh, Saga shoved her backwards, at which point she let herself fall backwards and splash down into the water and vanish without a fucking trace. I'm underwater! Run! I think she just stabbed me in the neck with her hand and gave me a game over. Or maybe she was shoving me down under the water. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh yes, these big doors. Tor! <laughs> There's something I can interact with over here. It's so dark. Oh, I'm sorry, kiddo. The hag tricked me. Tor, I'm here. I'm coming. Okay, I guess that's important. Standing out of the water. <laughs> Two green lights and a red light inside the central pillbox thing, but so I assume that means that two of the three things that need to be active for the uh, the lights to come on, or for the power I to come to on. Get the lights on to reach him. Oh 
god. Fine, fine. Aid kit, hot damn. All right, here we go. You took Tor. I'm here to take him back. She's coming. Underwater. Don't talk like that, Tor. Maybe if we call him Granddad, it would help, huh? Uh huh. huh? This is it for me. No, that's not it. I gotta get out of the water. In the dark. Gonna run for that thing. I can't stay in the water. So she just shows up and does a ton of damage to me if I stay under the water, I guess. Tunnels leading off to the side, but where are they? Barely see five. There must be a way to get the power back on. Feet in front of me. Oh, over there. Shit. Saga, why did you stop sprinting there halfway through? I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. She didn't grab us, so I guess I'm not that disappointed. She's coming. I'm pretty sure they play the climbing up animation faster than usual. And I don't really blame them. Fuck which way. Oh, come on! These are fuse boxes. Are they just painted on? Uh, I thought I was touching the water just there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh god, oh god, oh god. That's a generator. I need to find more generators. Ah, that's yes, good. This one can only be climbed up on from this side. Oh, oh, I saw that. Run! The darkness of a mental illness. That was a new one. Can't pick up that healing item. Uh, fuck! None of them will uh, empty the slot completely. Well, I might as well use one actually. Oh. I 
and stack it on top of the other ones. Oh, criminy! Power back online. I'm not leaving you here, Tor. Hold on. I like that mini game. The way that when you get the uh, oh, for Justin's sake, the mini game is a line dropping down a vertical uh, rectangle, and uh, when you line it up with the bright bit, then it works. You press A when it goes there, and it compresses everything up to the top and goes to the one below that. It does this three times in a row. You're you're golden. But I just I just like the way it squeezes everything up towards the top when you get it. Presses the, uh... Ah. Get back to the middle from here. Get the lights on. Oh, hell! Oh, it's cold. Huh? Hey, the water is gone. God damn thing. <sighs> Tell Odin. I'm sorry, I fucked everything up. You can apologize to him yourself. I'm getting you the hell out of here. Well, it seems a lot more doable, but I still need to... Oh. Oh, this is the story I came in. That's why there's that there. Oh, I see. No, I don't. Embarrassing. There's a fence there. Yeah, none of the uh, doors to the outer ring are open anymore, but I can go down here. Here. Yeah, staircase into a basement that wasn't there before. Or if it was, it was totally flooded. I guess there's that. Still in the uh, the haven. Thought it would change as soon as I set foot on the floor. And now Cynthia's floating around in the air, sending shock waves through the water and knocking down walls. Oh, those are projectiles. I thought those were weak spots, like the uh, the deputies had. Time after that. I can't see a goddamn thing. <sighs> Tell Odin. I'm sorry, I fucked everything up. You can apologize to him yourself. 
I'm getting you the hell out of here. Should compare those two lines to each other. The, the the way she said it while I was here the first time, the way she said it while I was running. I remember hearing that the. Uh... Oh. No, she just showed up on her own. I didn't have to step somewhere. Okay, trying to get out of the water there didn't work, did it? I take no joy in this. Oh shit! Somebody was running at me. but she swings twice and catches me after I dodge, or she does the thing where she, like, stumbles just as she reaches me so that her slap hits me after I'm finished dodging. After seeing her throwing fireballs and shockwaves around, I was not expecting her to just drop to the fucking floor and run at me. <laughs> Practically on all fours. I can't see a goddamn uh. thing. Hello. I'm sorry, I fucked everything up. You can apologize to him yourself. I'm getting you the hell out of here. Oh, I was starting to say before I got interrupted by the fight starting, uh, I remember seeing a thing where, uh... I think it was Spider-Man 2, the one that just came out, that, uh, the game, and I mean, not the movie from 2004, where, uh, they recorded every line of dialogue outside of cutscenes twice, I think it was. Once for if you're just standing still, like on a rooftop or something, and once for if you're in the middle of, like, web swinging or something when the when the line comes out, because the, uh, the second version has your guy's voice slightly under strain because he's doing a physical activity. I thought that was very interesting. I don't know that they didn't do that with the first one. I'm just saying that's what the, I heard about it with two. Hold. Shit, I didn't know it would go through. I thought it would stop at that for once. And then it would be uh, broken forever after. Oh, shit! Okay. Oh, that's just cheating. There was a big... 
fucking pillar there. And we're running, and we're reloading. Ah! You bitch. Oh boy. I very much don't like that. Maybe I can drive her off with that other flare. When she closes in like that. Oh no, the timer! I can't leave the episode here. Well, I guess I could, technically. Oh, but where'd be the drama in that? I'll give it one more shot. Dark. I can't see a goddamn thing. <sighs> Tell Odin. I'm sorry I fucked everything up. You can apologize to him yourself. I'm getting you the hell out of here. I still think it would actually help a lot if you called him granddad, told him you to listen to the record, and say that you forgive him even though you didn't remember he did anything wrong. Like, you know, I'm not proud of it, of uh, such things, but sometimes you really do need to just tell people what they need to hear. I'm not advocating lying to your loved ones in any sense. I'm just saying that sometimes uh, what you say is more important than uh, how strongly you mean it, you know? You know, Saga doesn't think of him as her grandfather, but if she called him granddad, the connection there might help her pull him back out. What the hell hope do any of us have if they could turn the Lady of the Light into this? Time was running out. Oh shit! Oh hell! Can't hit the... And we're running! Oh, shit! Oh, fuck! Well, if you're gonna do that, I'm gonna do this. Tasty! Love that bandage. Gonna use another one. an unlocked girl in love. And you again. The FBI. The FBI. Saga Anderson. I'm closer now. I can feel it. You help me get closer to escaping. Wake? Where are you? Is this coming from the dark place when you were still trapped? I have the clicker. We can finish this. Change the story. If this is the past, if 
this is you still in the dark place, then you can do that, right? You cannot write her in. She's my daughter, goddammit! Logan is in the story. I can get him to change it. No! I have the clicker. I'll make him change it now. He had no right to do this to Logan. To my family. Tor! Oh, oh, fucking hell. Are you okay? Uh, hey, it took your sweet time to come save your grandpa, huh? Nice attitude. A family trait? Uh, uh, you're right. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks like for helping out an old bastard like me. That's my job. Now, I've got some questions for you. <laughs> of course you do, sweetie pie. I like that he has a Poets of the Fall patch on his vest, in addition to all of the fictional bands. Look in the mirror, the cobweb of my soul. What's well, Poets again? On my face forever, seeking to be whole. Driven by passion. Ah, yes, of course. Raging like a storm, with thunder and lightning. The hubris I was born Blood hot and vain I rest to take it all Blind to your pain Your wounds My downfall You can't relight my fire When I say
dive through the dark to find a light on the other side. You will find in there the peace you missing. The man. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Alan Wake 2, when we find out what answers Tor has to give. Till then, take care of yourselves, stay out of the water, and stay in the light.